the end. That was a really good book. But what am I going to do now? Hmm. I got my slime. This is so purple and glittery. I'm going to take it out to stretch it. Let's see how good it stretches. Whoa! It's so glittery and I love purple. So pretty. And it's relaxing too. Vanessa, wake up! Time for dinner. Open the door. I need to talk to you. Uh, uh, coming, Mom! Uh, uh oh. This is not good. This is my new shirt. My mom's gonna get livid. No, 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 no. Um, why did I have to play with slime? Vanessa here. Um, today I'm going to be showing you how to take slime off your sheets, your clothes, your blankets, your pants, really anything. Um, excuse the mess in the background. I'm doing a Descendants 2 party. Um, but yeah, so um, as you guys saw that I spilled slime all over my shirt. And um, I'm going to teach you how to take it off. So, there's only two things you need, two wish things you need. So you need WD-40. And you need vinegar. And you want distilled vinegar. It doesn't really matter the, um, the brand. freshly spill on here so um I blowed it with the blow hair dryer and so now it's dry it's completely dry I think I'm, I'm pretty sure look at all the sparkles it looks so pretty um so yeah so I'm gonna grab my spoon and I'm gonna take my WD-40 and what you're going to do is you're going to shake it and then you're going to press right here. So shake it and press through. I don't know if that was a lot. Um, and you're going to take it off with your spoon. And you want to put more on it. A lot more. <laughs> Excuse me. I'm just going to like... So you can use one method, or you can use both of them. I'm going to be using both of the methods so that I can teach you and show you how to do both of them. Now you want to drench it, like soak it in the WD-40. So a lot. I think that's enough. 
why you want to do that. The reason why you want to do that is so that the slime really gets soaked in with it and it's easier to come off. So you want to leave it about a couple minutes, one or two minutes, and I'll be right back. Can't do it, Bob the Bip. Oh, sorry guys. <laughs> so, I have it on. I waited like about a minute or so. Now you're going to take it again and you're going to drench it again. You're actually first. Before you do that, you're going to take your spoon. I almost forgot what spoon is. <laughs> and you are going to try to take it off. Now, if you did it with acrylic paint or like any kind of things like that to color your slime, um, it will come off, don't worry. And what you want to do is you want to scrape it off. I put a lot of glitter in it. I just realized how much glitter I put in it. You see all of that coming off? Boy, that's a lot. So now there's the paint. So now what you're going to do is you're going to take your WD-40, I can never pronounce it right, you're going to take your WD-40 and you are going to dredge it again. So I'm going to shake it first, don't forget to shake it first, and there. <laughs> so again, like I said before, you're going to wait a couple of minutes and I'll be right back. In the very beginning, you can do one method, you can do both of them. I'm going to be doing both of them so that I can show you how to do them, both of them. So, it's a process. So, the next thing that you want to do, so you want to take it, wait, what did I do? Okay, you want to take it and you want to wet it in the vinegar. So, here's my vinegar in the, in the bowl. And what you want to do is, I'm going to put my hand in the shirt so that it's a bit easier. So mind you, this doesn't have to be just on a shirt. It could be like on pants or it could be um, blankets. It could really be in. So you really want to like rub it in so that some of the grease from the WD-40 um, can rub it off and the paint dissolves and you want to soak it in. It's already coming off really nicely. Do you see that? You want to wait one minute. One minute. One minute. I'll be right back. Bob the Builder, we can't do it, Bob. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Um, I've been watching Bob the Builder with my little brother TJ. He's not my real brother, but he's like my brother. He's my mom's son, but not my real mom. <laughs> um, I babysit him throughout the week. <laughs> Anyways, guys, um, so you can see that I really took this off. <sighs> so here's the thing, guys. Have you tasted these caramel M&M's? I'm officially addicted. Addicted. Look at them. Beautiful. Beautiful. I'm gonna take it. <laughs> so you can see that this really came off. There's still a little bit of glare on here, but 
what you're going to do is you're going to wash it in the washing machine and it'll all come off. But anyways guys, I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. Please give it a big like and subscribe because that would mean the world to me. Um, go check out my friend's videos Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. And on Friday. <laughs> but see you next Friday. Bye guys! Oh my god guys, I'm so sorry. I feel so bad. I never showed the final result. Well, here it is guys. It really came off really nicely. Now all you have to do is wash it. That simple. <laughs> Anyways, once again, guys. Bye. Mwah.